Hey guys, it's Colonel Deja Vu. Um, I just wanted to touch base on a few things not gameplay related. Um, first of all, school's starting soon, and basically all of us are on a routine where we go to bed around 1 in the morning and don't wake up till noon. And I don't know about all of you, but it kind of just smacked me in the face that I'm going to need to start getting up at 6 in the morning, going to bed at 9. Um, every day after school, I have loads and loads of homework to bring home and do uh, school sports. And I'm going to have a lot less time to post YouTube videos. Even though I just started, I'm going to have to really minimize YouTube and focus on my studies and schoolwork. Um, because I'm going into my freshman year of high school, so it's going to be a lot more work than I'm used to. And I'm planning on doing about four sports. I'm pretty athletic, and um, at least not not really during the summer. I actually tend to be really lazy during the summer. But during the school year, I'm pretty athletic and like to do a lot of things. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping I can at least get one video a day to you guys during... Um, during the school year, which means I'm probably going to have to rack up a lot of gameplay um, and put it in my storage. But yeah, and the reason I'm so... I, I do really have to focus on school. For those of you who don't know, I have really high goals. Um, I intend on... I want to go to Air Force Academy. I intended, I intend on enlisting in the Air Force after I go for get out of high school. And I want to be a pilot. I've wanted to be a pilot for a really long time. And for those of you who don't know this, to just to get into Air Force Academy, you need about at least a 4.0 GPA. You need to be a student leader, uh, be an honor society. You need to have multiple varsity letters in sports. It's debt, and you have to get a recommendation from a senator. It's not the easiest way to go to college, and it's not the easiest school to get into by any means. And basically, once you get into the Air Force, you work your ass off still. But I think um, I think that's uh, what I want to do. Um, I've wanted to be a pilot for a really long time. But other than that, uh, I just wanted to talk about a few quick things. One is kind of gameplay related, kind of uh, kind of Call of Duty related. Um, I I noticed I'm kind of getting sick of. Uh, Black Ops, Black Ops, and Call of Duty, and I think the reason is that I haven't been ranking up as much or caring about my win loss or KD because I'm really highly ranked on my old uh, Black Ops account. So I've decided to make a new account. Um, I think I'm only level two, no prestige, but uh, and it's the same name as my YouTube account, Colonel Deja Vu. So if you see me on that, that is the account, the only account I'm going to be playing on now. And yeah, so basically all of my uh, good times I've had playing Call of Duty are really competitive moments where I'm caring about and going, uh, what most people would say, really try hard. And I think that's what I intend on doing with, um, with uh, my new account. Um, this is a 10 minute long video. I don't really have any topics that were lined up for this because there, there hasn't really been much going on lately so it's it's, it's kind of hard to kind of hard to do this but yeah um I think I can come up with something all right but one thing I did want to talk about was the ps3 cross game chat um, everyone has been hoping or ps3 members I think I've kind of been hoping for cross game chat which if you don't know what that is is uh, where you can it's on Xbox Live you can basically talk to a friend in a private chat not text chat like we have on PS3 but voice chat over multiple games you can t like if I'm playing Call of Duty Black Ops and my best friend is playing Modern Warfare 2 we can talk to each other in a voice chat but it looks like that's not coming and all anticipations of that are completely crushed um it's about a couple months ago there were some rumors that were put out that it was coming in october and there were all these rumors about us having cross game chat but all of a sudden sony completely crushed all evidence of it and no playstation members really understood why but and now Sony's officially confirmed 
that cross game chat will never come to uh, PlayStation 3 and probably probably most of you are wondering why and that's what I'm gonna tell you first of all the PS3 has pretty specific RAM limitations RAM is basically memory and a space um, that it cannot support that the news came from a Eurogamer interview with uh, the Sony Worldwide Studios president he's Japanese I really don't know how to pronounce his name Shuhei Yoshida and um, the PS3 RAM is used by the game the system is running so basically the memory that is on the PS3 is all from the game you're playing so because of that the console can't support cross game chat like the 360 does um, and once a game uses RAM we can never get it back so it's not really possible to change something like that after the fact it's not possible to put out a update for the PlayStation and be able to use it because yeah um the cross game the argument about cross game chat has been I kind of like rekindled or brought back up sent ever since Sony announced um that the PlayStation Vita it's kind of like the company's next gen handheld video game system the next version of the uh PSP that is going to support cross game chat so basically uh, a PSP is able to support cross game chat but a PlayStation 3 is not able to because Sony just decided to be very dumb and they made the PlayStation so that it, it just can't support it they didn't think about it while they were making the PlayStation 3 and now they cannot fix it um what else should I talk about who Gamescom Gamescom so a lot of things were announced at Gamescom com about Modern Warfare 3. Gamescom, if you don't know, is like a huge, 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 huge um, event. Uh, a lot of the big time gamers went to it. I think X Jaws did. I think Mercadurka did. And Muzza Fuzza Gaming. If you don't know them, they're pretty big YouTubers. I think they all went there. Um, and they had a lot of news come out about Modern Warfare 3. And one of the funny things is that Robert Bowling, he's uh, the creative strategist for Infinity Ward, kind of said that he loves playing Battlefield 3. Um, he actually announced that, which, if you, if you think about it, that might raise some sales for Battlefield 3. And if you didn't know this, Battlefield 3 has already had more sales than Modern Warfare 3 in pre-ordering. Um, but kind of Infinity Ward, the leader of Infinity Ward, kind of just boosted sales for Battlefield 3. Um, I don't understand his motive to do that, but uh, we'll just leave it at that. It's also confirmed that on the PC version of Modern Warfare 3, um, the PC version of, multi of uh, Modern Warfare 3 is going to have dedicated servers, which basically means there won't be any connection problems because everyone is running on their own modem not hosted by someone else everyone has been hoping on xbox 360 and playstation 3 that this will come soon but i don't think they have enough we'll be able to do that i think it's pretty much been completely confirmed that there will be no dedicated servers for playstation 3 and xbox 360 users and the last thing is a uh, hundred percent legit information of the modern warfare 3 kill streaks was released and um I was thinking I'd give that to you in another commentary, um, tell you all about it. If you you can find it all over the internet, it's pretty well known now. And Infinity Ward's giving out strikes for it. But that's the end of my video. Subscribe, like, and comment. Bye. Hey guys, this is Colonel Deja Vu again. Sorry I forgot to mention this, but I think I'm going to be starting a Road to Commander series for any Call of Duty game. I don't know what it shit is. If you don't know what that is, it's basically where I post every game of on a Call of Duty game, me going from level 0 to 70. So you guys can see what it's really like me playing every game. I'm not only using my best games to put on YouTube. Basically, I'm going to do it. Whoever gives me, a, shoots me a PM saying any Call of Duty game, that's the game I will do it on first. If I do it, this is just, uh, just telling you in advance. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, bye.